Like and subscribe right now, or this spider will crawl on your face when you're sleeping. 10 Leaked Photos NASA Doesn't Want You To See NASA is notorious for making us flip our whole understanding of the universe just by posting a single controversial tweet. That's why they seem to be extra cautious every time they relay information to the public. That explains the rather quick posts that randomly disappear after seconds of getting posted. Hmm, why would they do this? Well, despite their sneaky ways of keeping these secrets, leaks do get to the wider attentive audience and some rather shocking findings break the internet. Today's photo has some of these amazing finds. Aliens? Maybe. Stick around until the end as we show you 10 leaked photos NASA doesn't want you to see. Number 10. The Genesis Crash In 2001, a mission known as Genesis was launched by NASA to collect a sample of solar wind particles streaming from our star and return them to Earth for analysis. The project turned out to be a flop after the spacecraft's wild plunge into the Utah desert. A design flaw in the re-entry system has been pinned as the most likely cause. Since the crash landing, researchers have been hard at work pulling science data from the fragments, but it has been a challenge. It's long been speculated that because of how terribly the mission went wrong, the Genesis is a source of great shame for NASA, resulting in embarrassing photos of the crash for the organization. Do you believe in aliens? Maybe this next clip will change your mind. Before we move on, I've got a little challenge for you that'll take 5 seconds to complete. So here's the deal, you just leave a like on this video, smash that subscribe button, and hit the notification bell, and you will get 25 years of amazing luck. Try it, it really works! Number 9. An Alien City in the Moon The fact that there are people who believe they have undisputed proof that aliens exist and that extraterrestrials are living and have built cities on the dark side of the moon is thrilling. To the naked eye, the Earth's moon looks dull and lifeless, but this is only this side facing Earth thanks to the gravitational pull of tides on our planet, a process known as tidal locking. This makes the other side a mystery so we cannot rule out the possibilities of alien life. However, NASA satellite images have revealed what lurks on the dark side, and they appear to show structures that cast shadows. All this was captured by NASA's Lunar Reconnaissance Orbiter (LRO), which has been surveying the desolate lunar surface since 2009. The images were analyzed by prominent conspiracy theorist Scott C. Waring, who claimed to have found an alien structure over 9 miles long on the moon's Demores Crater. He zoomed into the moon anomaly to focus on its grainy, indistinct details, which showed a huge solid object that was a circular tube. In addition to their strange appearance, Scott also noted that the clusters were built in a way that aligned with the topography of the lunar surface. They look like biomechanical structures grown by alien beings instead of being constructed. According to Scott, NASA has been hiding the evidence of extraterrestrial life forms. The image NASA shared with the public of their findings had been altered as the objects were edited out and they put a fake crater in the location. Suspicious? Very much. Number 8. NASA Uses Space Monkeys The term space monkey may sound familiar and this is because before humans went into space, several other animals were launched into space including numerous other primates so that scientists could investigate the biological effects of space travel. However, animal rights are getting better every day, so testing on animals is no longer the norm. That's why NASA tries to cover up all photographic evidence that they used to use monkeys. It's true that monkeys went into space long before we did. Many corporations are faced with so much scorn from the media if discovered. The first primate astronaut was Albert, a rhesus monkey who rode to over 39 miles on a V-2 rocket on June 11, 1948. Albert lost its life as a result of suffocation during the flight, which makes photographic evidence of him being prepped all the more embarrassing for NASA. Albert was followed by another rhesus monkey named Albert II, 
Although this capsule didn't get to cross the 50-mile barrier defining the edge of space, Albert II was the first primate NASA ever successfully launched. The mission commenced on June 14, 1949, and Albert II was killed on impact after a parachute failed during his descent. Number 7. Space Launch System NASA has been accused of secrecy after it released partially blurred out photos of the Space Launch System SLS, spacecraft. The SLS rocket was designed to take astronauts to Mars, which was seen in a one-of-a-kind send-off. Experts and NASA fans alike have been speculating why such a large portion of the rocket's body has been obscured in all the photographs. All released pictures of the rocket were blurred. Now, as much as we'd like to say the pictures were edited because a strange alien is clinging to the rocket, it is highly unlikely. The more realistic reason is perhaps that the images showed top-secret technology, which NASA didn't want to be seen by rival nations like China, which has been blamed for stealing intellectual property owned by corporations or other countries. Number 6. Red Planet Isn't Really Red Mars has for centuries been known as the Red Planet, but is it really red? Even though this planet has been depicted having a red hue color, recent photographs taken by NASA suggest otherwise. It depicts a raw color. Expect to find different depictions of the planet due to edits. NASA itself still seems confused at times about what Mars really looks like. Minerals also seem to affect the color shade the planet reflects as some landscapes can be more golden, brown, tan, or even a little greenish. Images captured of Mars are so detailed that scientists can examine the planet's feature at the scale of just a few feet. Number 5. The Delta II Rocket Explosion NASA has done lots of remarkable things, like when they landed Neil Armstrong on the moon, but they've also made some epic fails. Delta II was a rocket launch system originally designed and built by McDonnell Douglas. It entered service in 1989 as part of the Delta rocket family. This test launch wasn't successful and ended up in an explosion within mere seconds after engine ignition. This engulfed the launch pad in a giant fireball. Debris from the explosion fell into the Atlantic Ocean and on the Cape Canaveral Air Force Station. Thankfully, there were no injuries from the explosion. Evidence of this fail hasn't been documented anywhere, as if NASA was trying to cover its tracks. Number 4. Did NASA fake the moon landing? NASA doesn't want you to see this photo for a different reason. It took 400,000 NASA employees and contractors to put Neil Armstrong and Buzz Aldrin on the moon in 1969, but it took only one man, Bill Casing, to spread the idea that it was all a hoax. The photo of the two men on the moon potentially exposes the moon landing as a fake, and ever since this photo leaked, conspiracy theorists have used it as one of the key pieces of evidence in their theory that the moon landing was staged. Evidently, the photo clearly shows Neil Armstrong and Buzz Aldrin in a film studio. They're both in suits with the lunar landing set up. There are even rocks scattered across the ground to simulate the texture of the moon. What makes the situation more suspicious is the fact that the photo comes from NASA's archives. This could prove once and for all that the conspiracy theories are right, the moon landing never took place, and that it was all staged for the camera in a filming studio. What do you feel about this whole idea of the moon landing? Do you believe NASA made it there, or did we just get duped? The whole studio idea and the fact that it came from NASA's archives makes me a little paranoid. Number 3. The Moon Man From a lunar base to alien spaceships, the dark secrets hidden in the moon's surface have long been a source of fascination for conspiracy theorists. When searching for images on Google, you get to see this striking image of man on the moon for yourself by keying in certain coordinates. While for real, a YouTuber posted a video on his channel which circulated the internet and attracted millions of views. It showed what looked like a human figure standing on the surface of the moon. NASA, which checked the image against its trove of images from the same location, shrugged it off. But we have other images that don't show any imperfection. 
So, most analysts believe the image reflects nothing more than a tiny piece of debris on the lens. Yeah, right. And with that, it's now time for today's best pick. Today's photo was sent to us by a subscriber. So if you come across a photo online and want to know more details about it, just send it over to us. We might have been featured on a future video. Number two, a dragon? Sadly, this photo has nothing to do with NASA and has been used as a thumbnail on various clickbait videos talking about real live dragons. But who knows, maybe NASA knows a thing or two about dragons. Number one, NASA hiding a second sun? I bet we have all seen photos circulating the internet about a parallel universe known as Planet X where things run backwards. These have sparked up rumors that the world is reaching its end as a second sun was spotted plunging towards Earth. The resident who filmed the spectacular moment stressed the red object next to the moon was not a lens flare. Some people had information on this way before NASA announced that there was a new planet nine times the size of Earth lurking at the edge of our solar system. Many people believe NASA and other organizations have been hiding this information since they are notorious for such. And at this point, I'm just not sure what's real anymore. 